I think we're just gonna go ahead and start the meeting. So just wanna start off by welcoming everybody and thank you, thank you guys to everybody that decided to jump on the meeting today. Um, no, it's been a couple weeks before, you know, we have our another product, another product soon. But like I said, uh, my grandma, she's out right now and she is in Arizona. So she'll hopefully be home soon and we'll be able to do the product soon together again. But I just want to go over the basics. So I want to start off by explaining and talking about the endocannabinoid system and how important it is. So start off by saying the endocannabinoid system practically controls everything in your body. You have your CB1 receptors, which are controlling your brain and your central nervous system. So anywhere from anxiety, stress, insomnia, depression, um, inflammation, pain, your CB2 receptors, which is controlling your immune system, your gastrointestinal tract, your peripheral nervous system, a little bit of everything there as well. Um, so with the endocannabinoid system, it's ran off something called endocannabinoids, which is CBD molecules, something that our body is already naturally producing, uh, but with processed foods, everyday life, a lot of it has to do, um, a lot of it has to do with, you know, um, sorry, I'm trying to do two things at once, um, processed foods, everyday life, a lot of it just because our body's not being able to create something called homeostasis. So homeostasis is one of the biggest, most important things when it comes to the endocannabinoid system. Um, homeostasis is your body's balance. So whenever your body falls out of balance, and that could be from physical trauma, it could be from a psychological trauma. So for example, say uh, you have really bad anxiety and it was brought on by this certain someone. And What's happening is when your body falls out of balance, it's not being able to correct itself and there's no changes made, then you start noticing other issues, as in sleeping issues. But then you may notice mood issues. And then later on, you may notice that you're having um, uh, sleeping issues, mood issues, and then you realize that um, you're having appetite issues. So it's just something that you end up caught in this downhill spiral and you, you can't figure out a way to pull yourself back. Um, so that's why CBD is extremely important. It's replenishing your body of something that it's lacking. So let's talk about reaction. What is reaction? Why is it important? So the FSE, which what that stands for is a full spectrum extract. What that means is it contains everything out of the hemp plant. So that's terpenes, flavonoids, fatty acids, cannabinoids, THC, and what that does is that maximizes your benefits. So when you have everything, for example, terpenes, terpenes is what gives the plant its color and its smell, but it also is anti-inflammatory, antibacterial, anti-cancer, anti-fungal. It has tr tremendous benefits to it. So when you're putting all those together, you're getting a lot of benefits there. Um, one of the big important parts that I really like about reaction is that everything is controlled under one one lab it's from the seed to the bottle to you and what that means is so the farmers first of where it starts the hemp plant itself the hemp plant the way it grows is extremely important to make sure that you're getting good good quality plant before it's being extracted because the hemp plant itself is something called an accumulator plant meaning that it soaks anything up out of the ground and so one of the why is that such a big deal? Because you don't want the soil to contain something in it that's bad and then this plant's going to soak it up and then you're going to ingest that. You don't want that. So one of the big things about this company is the farmers are under strict, strict contracts and they have to test all these soils and they have to constantly, whenever it's growing, they constantly keep an eye on it and they're constantly getting the plant tested to make sure that it is high quality. And then you have um, the extraction process itself. The extraction process is a proprietary patented extraction process, meaning this machine was built directly behind how to extract everything out of the plant and make sure that nothing is getting left behind. So why is that a big deal? Because it's not gonna be a true full spectrum if it's just a CO2 
cold press. You're only getting one molecule out of it. With this, you're getting everything and you're not leaving anything behind. But one cool thing about the extraction process is that we use something called nanotechnology. So being able to extract everything and extracting everything into the point where it's nanotechnology, meaning that it's broken down into these small molecules, meaning your body can absorb 100% of it, which is amazing because most of the CBD products that you find out in the market today are you know, your normal isolates, your broad spectrums, what a lot of people are calling full spectrums that aren't full spectrums, your body's only being able to absorb around 30 to 50% of those, which isn't that great. So with this, your body's being able to absorb all of it. And one of the main key factors in FSE, because it is a true full spectrum, it gives you the entourage effect, meaning that everything is going to work together. It's not going to work, you know, this one's working here, this one's working there kind of thing. Everything's going to be working together and it gives you something called homeostasis. So it actually puts your body and allows your body to get into the homeostasis. It allows it to balance itself. So it starts correcting all the hormones, anything that could be messed up about it. So that's one of the biggest things um, when it comes to FSC products and why I believe that FSC reaction is the best product that I've ever seen. And I know it from my personal testimonies, my friends' personal testimonies, and you know all the wonderful people in this company, people that have shared their testimonies. So let's get into one of the most important parts, um, the products, of course. So there's a lot of different types of products. There's a lot of different ways to consume CBD. So one of those ways is a tincture. So a tincture is something that you do sublingually, meaning under your tongue. Uh, a lot of people think that's weird. Why would you do it under your tongue? When you do it under your tongue, it's the fastest way in your bloodstream. So you know that your body is absorbing it, you know, extremely fastly. So with um, the oil, there is two different milligrams. There's a 500 milligrams and a thousand milligrams, and it's the same size bottle. It's just the different concentration in each bottle. Um, then those comes in, co those come in four different flavors. So there is honey, natural, blue raspberry, and the new orange, which is phenomenal. If you haven't tried it, you should try it. And then it comes in also travel size, little guys. Um, you can use these to share with friends, share with family if you want them to try them. A lot of the time, some people, when they travel, they take them because it's a little bit easier. They don't want to lose their bottle or even as an extra dosage. I always carry one in my bag just in case, say I had something come up at work, something that was stressful, and I can just have my extra dosage. So then getting into the capsules, the capsules, um, one of the important things about a capsule is it's not going to work as immediate. Your body's not going to absorb it as fast as what a tincture would. Um, but one of the thing, cool things about a capsule is that the effects last a little bit longer whenever you're digesting something. So whenever you take a capsule, it takes about 30 minutes to an hour for it to actually dissolve and your body to start absorbing it. And then, but you're going to get the effects that last a little bit longer. So, the capsules come in 1,000 milligrams and 250 milligrams. The 1,000 milligrams is a 30-day supply, and then it also comes in a seven-day trial for, you know, if you want to use it for samples, if you want to take it on the road kind of thing. And then you have your lip balm, one of actually really cool. I just recently have never been a lip balm person ever um but since it's cold out i've been having like my lips starting to get like extremely like red around the, and i feel and they're just dry and cracking and i'm like what is going on uh started using this and within the day it was almost gone so just because it's cold i've been using it pretty frequently um love the lip balm and then topicals so topicals is one of the most popular ways um, a lot of people like to um, try CBD um, and why that is is because topicals usually work pretty immediate it's for your spot pains or your spot you know air errors that you may have in your skin um, it's not usually tended to use for like a long-term thing uh, but the topicals come in four different formulas 
So there is relief. Relief is for your instant pain cream. So if you have a rotator cuff surgery, if you have any you know, aches and pains that you're having because of the cold weather, it's really good just to rub on the pain, past the pain. And what's really cool about this, because it is a true full spectrum, it is more of an oil-based. Um, it's not gonna be like your white lotion, what a lot of people expect it to be. You can kind of see that it is that green, almost oily um, type and why that is, is because true full spectrum can't be water soluble. So in order to get it into this white lotion, um, it's not able, you're not able to do that with a true full spectrum. Uh, so, but the cool thing about an oil, because it is more oil based, it tends to last you a lot longer, be able to spread out a lot further and your body absorbs it a little bit easier. So there's relief and then there is recovery. Recovery is for your joint and your muscle pains, for anybody that works out a lot, or anybody that is in construction, a job that you're constantly, you know, using your muscles and you may get sore, um, that's a really good one for that. And then you have Revive. Revive is gonna be your anti-aging, any skin elements that you have um, that you just wanna rub it right on there. There's been a lot of testimonies that are actually really cool. I've seen a little bit more, um, I've seen, a lot more testimonies with that with even you know wrinkle creams and stuff that you see uh frequently and then you have the new one which is renew uh renew is you know been extremely popular right now uh what a lot of people have been using it for is uh psoriasis and uh i can't remember the word right now psoriasis and um Brain farts. Eczema. Eczema. Thank you, Nana. Uh, so psoriasis and eczema, which is extremely uh, big right now. I see, you know, a lot of people that have been struggling with that and a lot of the medications and the prescriptions that aren't working for them. Uh, but I've seen this do wonders. So definitely, definitely give it a try or reach out to people if you know if you have it or if you do try it out. So it comes in pump bottles. So you can get it in a little pump bottle. And then it also comes in a salve or salve, however you would like to say it, um, which is more like a Vaseline for those who don't know what it is. And then also it comes in a travel size as well. So the little travel sizes that you can just squeeze out. And this is extremely concentrated. A lot of people that come to me and say, you know, these travel sizes are really small. Are you sure I'm gonna notice it? They're extremely concentrated, both of this. This is 2,100 milligrams, and this guy's little 500 milligrams. So you're gonna get a pretty heavy dosage um, in each one of those. So yes, they do work just as well as the bigger bottles. So next we have a Repet line, which there's been a lot of testimonies about those guys too, and my cat would have a fit if I don't use this on her food. Um, but they have, that comes in a tincture oil as well. You can either apply that in your animal's mouth um, if they allow you to, or you can put it on a biscuit, little treat, or put it directly on their food. I would recommend if your animal has trouble not eating all of its food and just if it's a eater throughout the day, then I would rather you dose them through their mouth or put it on a treat that you know that they're gonna eat right then and there just because you wanna know that you're being able to maintain the dosage that they're getting every single day. Um, but it comes in the tincture oil and then it also comes in a capsule and then you can get it in a syringe. So the syringe is gonna be really concentrated, um, but it's more of the actual, it's not gonna be oil based, it's gonna be a little bit thicker. So I always suggest, I don't, wouldn't put it on your animal's food. I know people that haven't had no issues, but what I do just so you know your animal's getting it is put a little, you know, tiny rice grain on a treat and give it to them like that. And then also, the pet line, there is also a salve as well. So I had somebody look at me crazy when I said a salve for pets and I'm like, I have to shave my animal's hair. Like, no, it's not for that. It is for any um, hot spots that your animal has, any areas that you tend to notice that they're itching or constantly biting at, any paws that you see that are pretty torn up, you know, from damage of them running around, scratched up. Um, 
but that stuff works wonders. There's thousands of testimonies on that. There was all over Facebook and all over the reaction page within the hair growing back in like five days. Some pretty, pretty crazy stuff. So definitely check the pet line out. So just, I know we went over, um, I'm gonna talk a little bit about the edibles and then we're gonna get into, of course, the new gummies. Um, so the edibles, there is three different types. There's chocolate, there's fudge, and there's caramels. All of those come in a little box. It is 40 milligrams, so they're 10 milligrams a piece and it comes four in a pack. Um, the chocolates, they're, they're all gonna be assorted. So the chocolate is Thin Mint, strawberry, orange, and chocolate, yes. And then you have your fudge, coffee. coffee, that's right. And then you have your fudge, which is gonna be um, chocolate, um, watermelon, thin mint, and uh, key lime pie with the crust, chocolate, thin mint, and watermelon covered all those guys and then your caramels are going to be just a milk chocolate and a dark chocolate so two of each of those guys all of them are extremely extremely good sometimes I just crave it um, but that's a really good you know at night time whenever you want to do that um, but one of the biggest things that I did want to talk about after talking about the products is dosage so that's a frequently asked question dosage and apparently there, there's been a lot of people that immediately jump to the conclusion that it has something to do with your weight and your size. Just like any medication, any cough syrup, you look at the weight, you see how much you have to take. When it comes to CBD, it has nothing to do with your weight, has nothing to do with your size, has nothing to do with your age. It's all depending on your body, your endocannabinoid system, and your metabolism. With adults, I always suggests the average dosage, which is 33.3 milligrams of CBD that you consume on a day-to-day -day basis in order to see, you know, change throughout, you know, the week of you being on it. But also, if, for example, for a child, since they're a lot younger, smaller, their metabolism runs a lot faster, um, they tend to need a lot more CBD than what just an average human would need. I always suggest an extra 10 to 15 milligrams if it's just an average anxiety or stress um, ADHD uh, child that's on it. An extra gummy, what a lot of parents do is they put it in, you know, the lunchbox, but they do the average in the droppers. So just for example, if you're trying to get that average dosage off of 500 milligrams, that would be two full droppers a day, once in the morning and once at night. Um, the thousand milligrams, that would be only one dropper a day. I always recommend splitting it up like a half in the morning, half at night. You are going to be doing the thousand milligram oil. The capsules, all of those individually are one capsule is 33.3 milligrams already. Uh, what a lot of people do, a little bit more severe cases, people that are having, you know, arthritis issues, pain issues, a lot of little bit more severe issues like that. What a lot of people do is they do uh, either 5,000 or 500 milligram um, full dropper tincture oil in the morning, and then they do one capsule at night. That tends to work really best for a lot of people. That's what it tends to see uh, more frequently is that that's how a lot of people do it just because it helps with them with that sleep and it helps them get to that REM sleep, which is extremely important. So let's talk about why we are all pumped up and that's going to be the gummies. So I don't know if anybody ordered their gummies and they've got them or if they picked them up, um, but I got my gummies uh, today and they are extremely great tasting. I will be honest with you. I don't really taste any. I get that little earthy taste, but really I don't, I don't have any issue with, issues with them. I can eat them like candy, so I need to be careful. But let's talk about how awesome it is that there's 10 that come in a bottle, they're 10 milligrams a piece, and they're only $18.99. I think that alone is pretty incredible. You pretty get a pretty good bang for your buck. Um, I know like the fudge and the chocolate alone, it was 40 milligrams, and they were $18.99. Little bit different. Um, type of food, but the gummies are amazing. Um, I do love them because they're perfect for kids. Um, that's one of the biggest reasons that I was extremely excited about this is because I know that there's a lot of people that have been, you know, struggling how to send their fudge or their chocolate to school for that extra dosage or those people that were, you know, just doing it through tincture wise, but I'm really excited for this. Number one for um, the kids, 
but also for the adults, they're really good, like extra dosage if you ever need them. Um, I'm going to try them out and just bring them as a spare. So if any, you know, say something crazy at work happens and I, you know, have a little stress issue, I can just take one and immediately get that relaxation feeling. I'm going to try them tonight. Um, like I said, my fiance is already eating half the bottle that's, um, that's almost gone. Thank God I got two. Um, but I'm definitely super excited and really excited to share with about these gummies with everybody because like I said, they do taste phenomenal. You know, they're not going to be, they're not expensive. So those alone, that's amazing. So let's talk about kind of going a little bit more depth about the gummies. Um, one of the things that I do want to point out why I love this company so much is because they put so much thought and they put so much care into each ingredient that they put, put in each product. All these products, they could just have their normal coconut oil, what a lot of people do, but they put a lot of research, like I said, into finding these, you know, um, these different types of ingredients that they're going to put into this just to make sure that it's been benefiting us as much as possible and to make sure that it's as completely natural and as completely organic as it can get. So that's one thing that I'm really excited about. Um, but I, like I said, I always do a little bit of research for people that don't know, we do a star product of the week. Um, when me and Lindy do these zooms together, like I said, Star products is going to be the gummies, of course. So I always go into depth kind of what's in the product. So starting off, one thing that's in the product is called citrus acid. Um, so citrus acid, acid, after all the research that I did about it, um, it's really good for uh, your body to help um, your body absorb nutrition. So any nutrition that could be being lost through daily foods, even the FSC products alone, it helps your body cling to that and it helps it start absorbing what it needs to be, uh, begin, begin absorbing. Um, also helps with bone health. Uh, it's a lot of the times uh, used, it has a lot of antibiotic uh, properties to it as well. So citrus acid has a lot of um, benefits to it. One big thing, um, that, like I said, that I like about the company is they, they do that extra research, but MCT oil, MCT oil, we've talked about multiple, multiple times and almost each one of these products have, has MCT oil in it. Um, but just to go over a little bit of the benefits of that again, um, it's really, really healthy for your brain. And so it helps the memory and it helps, um, that part of your brain that controls the memories. Um, it's really healthy for that. It's really good for energy to help your body whenever it knows when to relax and when it's need, needed for energy. So it helps your body contain those nutrients so you your body be energized when it needs to be. It helps with weight balance. It also has been known to help cholesterol. It's also been known to help blood sugar. Those are really big important, important key factors in this. Um, so also what, of course, forms the gummies is gelatin. Um, I've done a lot of research on gelatin because, you know, some people have bad stigmatisms in their head about certain products, so it can be good. Um, but a lot of the research that I've done, it's shown really, um, really good benefits to um, your skin health. Also been known to help your digestion. It's been uh, known to help joint pain and inflammation issues. It's helped uh, lower blood, blood sugar. It's also been known to strengthen your bones. So those are some pretty cool things. Um, the ingredients that are in it, of course, you're going to have your FSE. Like I said, each one of them are 10 milligrams, which is awesome. But one important thing that the company, if you guys were not on the Zoom last night, is that the company actually put a special gummy in each one of our bottles. Sadly, not mine. Um, but... In random bottles, I think they said something about it last night. There's up to 50 different gummies that they put in each bottle. Um, and it's going to have a R resemblance. So it's going to be like a little circle with an R um, gummy. And when you have one of those, you're supposed to take a picture and send it to the company. Because what that means is that you just won $100 to $150 worth of promotional stuff to better you and your business. That is freaking awesome, if you ask me. Um, 
just because I knew I was already going to order the gummies. Everyone should go order the gummies. But on top of that, if you get an R, you're going to get $100 worth of free stuff. So who doesn't like that? Uh, but all the gummies, they're just like normal little gummy bears that you see. Um, the little coating on it, it's just sugar, so it tastes good. Um, but like I said, I cracked open right when I got them. I it was like a little kid open up a Cracker Jacker box and open them up and dumped them all out to see if I got the R. I didn't, but I'm going to order more. It's okay. Um, but definitely make sure that you don't forget about that. Everybody, I really do suggest that you try these gummies. They are good. They are extremely, extremely affordable. And it has FSC in it. So this time, I think we are going to open it up to any questions that anybody has. You can either type them in or just ask. Um, you have the little mute bar. You can just unmute it. If you're too shy to, of course, you can um, submit it in the group chat in the little chat bar at the bottom. But like I said, I just want to thank everybody for joining the Zoom tonight. Hey, Victoria, this is Joni. Um, hi, Joni. The, hi, the gummies are 10 milligrams each gummy? Yes, ma'am. Okay, so and I, if we take a 1,000 milligram tincture at night, is that something that is in place of the the tincture during the day i'm just trying so, to equate how it how they so the gummies what a lot of people do i personally know people i know my grandma works with uh, a gentleman that only doses off of edibles that's not something i would suggest doing is just dosing off of edibles which i know you're not asking um but i thought i should put that in there just because when you're dosing with an edible, you're going to have to be taking at least three to four of those edibles a day in order to get that average dosage that each, you know, everybody's body needs, which means you're going to constantly be spending more money. The best way to do it is going for an oil or a capsule, something that's going to last you a little bit longer. What the gummies are intended for, just like you can, you know, sub out for a topical or, um, but like, for your bad day, a day that you, you know, had a lot of stress and you needed a little bit of extra boost, you can just take a gummy. A night that you want to sleep really good, um, you can just take one of those gummies. It, like I said, they're 10 milligrams a piece. If you're doing a thousand milligram dropper, um, a tincture oil, that's about 33 milligrams just in one dropper. If you're doing it, I would just recommend trying it because like I said, a tincture oil is a faster reactor. You're going to notice it a lot faster. Um, but one of the biggest differences that is uh, with an edibles, it's going to take a little bit longer for you to notice it because it does have to digest. It's about that 30 minutes um, to an hour to digest. I mean, everybody's body's different, but it's going to last a little bit longer. So it's okay. like that extra dose kind of thing. And I misspoke. I was thinking about the thousand milligram capsule at night. Oh, oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I apologize. I wouldn't talk about No, you're about fine. Yeah. The capsule, if I take the well, capsule. pretty equivalent then. Okay. <laughs> the okay. capsule is going to be a little bit stronger. Yeah. And then I just, I can take the gummies during the day instead of the tincture, correct? You could. Yes. Yeah, since the capsule, you are only, you know, that's pretty much your daily dose, but you can do like, you know, a gummy or a gummy, two gummies in the afternoon. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> Anybody else that has any questions? Uh, Victoria, um, <laughs> I'm standing outside. It's a little chilly here, but um, I did want to say that I can't wait to come back home in a couple weeks so I can see everybody. But um, I wanted to let people know I'll be doing a meeting in California, actually for Lori, who I see is on this meeting. And I ordered quite a few gummies last night, so I cannot wait to get them. But um, if anybody has anybody that's in the Antelope Valley area, New Hall, Santa Clarita Valley, just get a hold of me and we can, I'll let you know when the time is going to be and we can talk to some of your people if you have somebody in California. Well, awesome. That is great to hear. Complaining about it's cold when it's 20 degrees, um, but it's okay. <laughs> I know. Um, it's not hey, Victoria. <laughs> hey, Jeff. Hey there, how are you? Great job, by the way. Um, hey, Lindy, do you, I know you mentioned you would let us know the time. Do you know the date or the day that you're going to be having the meeting in California? Uh, actually, I'm going to be getting with Lori tomorrow, but it should be next either. Uh, I'm going to be there for three days. 
So okay. I can do, you know, do that follow up meeting the next day. Um, so I'm, what I'm shooting for right now is Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday of next week. And okay. I will let you know for sure as soon as I talk with Lori tomorrow. Awesome. Sounds great. And it's going to be very casual. We're not having it at a, at a rented room. We're going to do it at her house or her right. sister's sure. house. It'll be very casual, um, kind of sit around the table kind of thing. And we'll go over the products and I'll be showing off those new gummies. <laughs> Sounds <laughs> awesome. <laughs> yeah. So I'll let you know for sure, Jeff, and I'll put it up on my Facebook. So if anybody has anybody that is in the area that they might want to, uh, get somebody over to the meeting, just let me know. Sounds perfect, Lindy, thank you. You're welcome. Hey, Victoria, great job recapping everything tonight. It's Rachel. Um, <laughs> excited, I ordered six bottles, so I I'm just so kidding. I, my mom, you know, she'll, she would like to get a bottle, but I also like to get do giveaways, as you know, in my group, but um, Smart. either way, I'm gonna, I can tell you guys, I do a capsule every evening and I do an edible, um, you know, like you said, you know, when I want a better night's sleep or just because I love the chocolate or caramels, but, uh, <laughs> and I have no issues, um, you know, backing into one edible with the capsule at night at all. Um, if anything, I just feel better even before I go to bed and sleep better, but I am going to caution people when they get the gummies to just take one you know if they're new to reaction wait like 30 minutes you know to an hour I'm a little afraid <laughs> they're gonna you know just start popping them in their mouth right like oh trust time. me yes I've had that yes they yeah are, and what they are what I, really good but they are not candy <laughs> they have 10 milligrams which is extremely strong right and one of my ambassadors Nicole who I think is on um someone that she sent I think it was chocolates too as a gift. They ate the whole box and in one evening and didn't feel so great the next morning. Um, so I do think it's important that especially with gummies for some reason, you know, they're so little. <laughs> yeah, they don't seem like much, but they're definitely powerful little guys. You don't want to be eating too many of them or you're going to pass out and, you know, it's going to be a really great sleep, but if you're not intending for it, just make sure, just because like Rachel said, you want to wait about 30 minutes, anywhere from 30 minutes to an hour with any type of CBD edible when it comes to reaction, because your body is having to break it down and digest it before it actually can, you know, before you start feeling the reaction. So definitely wait about 30 minutes before you want to get, take that extra little gummy. Thank you for that one, Rachel. Is there any more questions anybody has? I'm looking in the chat bar and I'm not seeing anything. All right, I don't think there's any more, but you guys can all reach out to me. I know I did put my phone number in the chat bar, um, but you guys can reach out to your upline or reach out to anybody if you guys have any questions or any concerns or anything like that. Um, but I just want to thank you guys for joining tonight. Definitely super excited about the new edibles. I'm super excited to share these with all my friends and all the people that are in, you know, my family that I want to get involved and gummies are going to be a perfect way to, you know, give them that, you know, sample let people try it, but I'm excited for it for me personally. But thank you guys for everything. If you guys ever need anything, please reach out. But everybody have a great night.